This film is going to open huge. With your movies in a minute, I'm Bruce Miller. Bruce Miller. Woof, woof. The movies are going to the dogs this weekend in a big way. Beverly Hills Chihuahua opens Friday, and it's going to be so huge, you'll think Chihuahuas have taken over the world. The reason? The movie has that cute factor that kids love and parents don't mind. Who am I? The question is, what am I? I'm a Chihuahua. Chihuahua. Basically an animated film, it uses the techniques that failed in Underdog to make a herd of dogs sing, dance, talk, and play. Now the title pooch has been turned over to a babysitter. She loses little Chloe and the adventure begins. In short, the film is just another 101 Dalmatians. It features the voices of Drew Barrymore and a bunch of B-list actors. It isn't great or even that funny but it is marketable, so shake a tail and get moving. It's gonna be number one at the box office and maybe two stars on our list. Also this week, look for seven more new films with varying degrees of quality. Among the more notable ones, Nick and Nora's Infinite Playlist. Now, if you were a fan of Juno, you'll realize this film is trying to bask in a bit of that one's glow. I wanted to talk to you. You know, I think we both said some things we didn't mean, like when you broke up with me on my B-Day. Michael Sarah stars as a kid who's just been dumped by his girlfriend. To make it look like he isn't wallowing in self-pity, he befriends a girl named Nora, and they have a night of fun. Well, sort of. In Flash of Genius, Greg Kinnear plays a guy who invented the intermittent windshield wiper. That's right, the intermittent windshield wiper. He goes after the automakers who claim he didn't. In How to Lose Friends and Alienate People, Simon Pegg turns up as an obnoxious writer who lands a job at a high-profile New York magazine. Kirsten Dunst co-stars. And in Blindness, the one thought provoker of the week, Julianne Moore plays a woman who retains her sight while those around her lose theirs. Now, the film's received complaints from several blind organizations, but they don't have much to worry about. This week, it's all about the dogs. With your movies in a minute, I'm Bruce Miller.